Hi Pisces. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Pisces. See it? See it? Happy birthday to you. Whoever turns this channel on is immediately protected. You see it? I am. <laughs> Hi, I'm Tara. I'm your High Priestess. There was a lot of noise going on outside. I did a reading for you and I was completely interrupted and I lost the entire thing. So I had to start from scratch, Pisces, and I'm not too happy about it. Not that I don't, I'm not happy because, you know. chaos going on in your life right now? <laughs> a lot of noise, a lot of chaos. You know? Hi, my name is Tara. I'm your high priestess. I am divinely protected by the Archangel Michael, so I want you to turn on this channel to watch this reading. You are immediately protected. I have angels at my windows, at my doors, at my archways. So if anybody comes into my space, the sword of Archangel Michael will cut all cords of negativity very well. Um, I have videos showing me Showing me, showing you um, the violet flame being invoked. I have a video of three confirmations that Archangel Michael is here with us, protecting us. Um, on my Facebook page, I am on a group. Um, channel Tarot Card Readings by Tara Harper Elts. I believe I'll put it in the inbox. Um, during that group, I have the entire Zodiac um, for karmic, the karmic cycle. I just finished, you guys, last night. I'm done with it. So now I'm doing your birthday. What's for the future of your birthday? And do your, what does your future look like? 333 on the clock. Um, what does your future look like? And then... For your love after that. Um, I am I am not a professional tarot card reader, but I do communicate with spirit. I have been since I've been a little girl, since around five, as I remember. So in order for me to get messages out to others, this is my platform of how I do it. I also accept donations on Cash App. I'll put that in the description box also. I also am on Instagram. I just started doing a um, general reading. It's only like 15 minutes long um, with Isis. It's Cleopatra. I think I put some of those on the YouTube videos. I like Facebook because I can go live. I can't do live on face on YouTube because I don't have the, um, do I have to show you? <laughs> uh, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to give you that energy. The noise is distracting me a bit. <laughs> 
so I apologize. And then I did the entire spread, and then half of it had to get paused, and I had to have a part two, and then during the part two, my phone just kept ringing, 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 and wouldn't stop ringing, and there was nothing I could do, and then when I picked it up, everything got deleted. I was so upset. I did ask Spirit to step forward to deliver your birthday messages for you. I miss YouTube. It's just I don't get the love here like Facebook. I want the love. I want your love. Show me your love. Show me love. I have a lot of stuff going on. A lot of strange energies. I'm trying to figure out who I am. I'm trying to figure out who you are. We're on this journey together. I'm here to enlighten those who are not enlightened to help guide those who need guidance. Guidings. <laughs> no. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it how I usually do it. This is your birthday. This is your beer birthday reading. This is for... This is going to be for your... This reading is going to be for... Now to your current future you know, within the next month or two. So anything beyond that, I wouldn't say. Again, time's linear, time doesn't exist. So um, I guess whenever you turn this channel on, if you're guided to this channel and it resonates, hit the like button, hit the subscribe, and my angels will bless you. Trust me, they'll bless you. Check my videos out. My little cat. I'm just chillaxing today. Huh. I mean, really, I hate when they do that. How's everyone doing on their birthday? I smell food. I'm stuck. Come to my Facebook group page because I go live over there. I'm not sure what I'm going to do next after the karmic cycle. That was a stressful one. The ones to watch are Leo. That was pretty... It's not like your ordinary tarot card readings like this is going to be. This is going to just be, you know, just a... <laughs> you're reading but the other ones get like it's like an hour hour and a half almost two hours long and a lot of it's channeling the leo's pretty intense taurus is pretty intense <sighs> see the leo one and then i have a video of um dancing with the devil waltzing with the devil that's a good story Okay, we're going to start with deck one with four cards. And this is for Pisces birthday month. And this is for now to... <sighs> Not too far into the future energy. The next few months, I would say. One more card for Pisces. Please. Thank you, Spirit. My, 
I do read from the book, so I want to make sure you guys get the messages correctly. Five of Swords. Too dark now. I don't know, maybe it's too dark. I'm having deja vu. I'm having deja vu, deja vu, <laughs> deja vu about late. There are no lights illuminating around me. Interesting. The next deck. Ugh. Sorry. All right. I think we're good. I think we're good. <laughs> I'm gonna have over there. All right. Next card we have is Seven of Wands, and this is for your um your what's coming up for your. Future for um, your current future for just general King of Cups, Ooh. Queen of Swords. Look at her; she looks like she um, caught that duck. She caught that duck. The Five of Swords is attention, conflict, defeat, change in perspective, moment of truth, a wake-up call, <laughs> swift change in perspective based on new revelations, the need to accept that a current problem or conflict doesn't have a, doesn't have a satisfactory solution. You may need to cut your losses and move on. The opportunity to learn from defeat. The need for courage and self-confidence in the face of adversity. Choose your battles wisely. There's a wake-up call. A swift change. New revelations. You may need to cut your losses and move on. Choose your battles wisely. Don't fight battles that you can't win. Seven of Wands is next. I don't know what that means, but, you know, we'll find out. Seven of Wands is competition. Overcoming challenge, defensive advantage, self-confidence, strength. A person or situation is stirring up a dynamic energy. An advantage over adversities, being challenged or opposed by others. By having the necessary experience and abilities to emerge victorious. Standing up for oneself and one's belief. Choosing battles wisely. Success despite criticism. So conflict, defeat, change, perspective, mo mo so moment of truth goes into strength, self-confidence. Moment of truth comes. Moment of truth, there's a wake-up call. And a person is stir situation is stirring up an energy um, the abilities, standing up for yourself and one's beliefs. You're standing up for yourself and one's beliefs. Choosing battles. You're still choosing battles wisely. Ability to beat the odds. Success despite the criticism of op oppositions. So there's, you have a wake-up call. You have to face something. 
Again, you'd have to choose your battles wisely. But despite all of that, you're going to have the strength, the self-confidence, and you're going to beat the odds. You're going to beat the odds in something. And that's going to give you the King of Cups. Good for you. Happy birthday. If you got a situation going on and you want to, doesn't look good, well, you better like and subscribe because you'll beat the odds. Enjoyment, blessings, compassion, advice, emotional balance, spirituality, blessings and good feelings abound, a generous and consistent feeling that all is well, a cause for major celebration, gaining mastery in spiritual awareness and connection, a loyal, reliable, and considerate person, devotion, honor, warmth, compassion. awesome to the queen of swords that's awesome Pisces I'm, I don't know what to say I'm happy for you I know Pisces queen of swords independence perception intelligent oh intellect I'm sorry Cutting away what no longer serves, whether a relationship, plans, or habits, or thinking. Coming to a sudden, profound understanding. Victory over puzzling obstacles. Taking an organized objective, methodical approach to tasks and problems. A person who displays the qualities of strength, pa patience, intelligence, intellect, and wit. Someone who is loyal, but also protective of their interests can indicate a widow or mature single woman. I love you. I love you. Deck two, one card. I love you. One card for Pisces birthday in general. Thank you, Spirit, for those messages. That's awesome. Page of Swords. Curiosity, intelligence, perception, diplomacy, truth. Taking on new studies or training. A person who is inquisitive, determined, logical, self-assertive, and or honest, as well as impulsive, learning to be diplomatic when speaking the truth, a message that's difficult to hear, the need to accept difficult truth in order to move on, vigilance and discretion will respect to potential gossip or people with contrary or insecure motives. One card. And then after that, I'm going to put the love and then I'm going to confirm what these mean. 
one card for Pisces birthday for their near future. What they need to know for their mm, thank you, spirit. It's time to get in the chariot, get in the car. It's time to move, 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 move. Time to move, 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 move. We'll figure that out in a minute, okay? We gotta move for. Let's start your love now. Deck one, three cards. This is your love. This is your love, Pisces. What's your love for a current to near future? Your love, Pisces, for your birthday. Three cards. One more card. Deck one, deck one, one card. Um, King of Swords. Knight of Pence. I'm going to throw them all out. Two of Wands. I'm going to keep continuing. I'm going to one card. And then I'll, we'll see. Nine of Wands. Card for their love. One card for Pisces love. Six of Swords. King of Swords is the father. King of Swords. Is a rational person, authority, a powerful, decisive, dipl diplomatic, a strong, analytical intellect. As a side meaning, can refer to a legal or con con contractual matters or official documents. Goes to the Knight of Pentacles. Stability, security, progress, rely reliability, good luck with money and career, methodical, steady progress, a reliable and honorable person who is grounded and responsible, one who demonstrates loyalty, prudent action, and self-reliance. Two of Wands. Progress, planning the future, decisions, reliable partner, making future plans for a stable and optimistic vantage point, assistance and progress in career endeavors, equal partnership. Okay, so an equal partnership for somebody. To the nine of wands. Assistance, persistence, courage, vigilance. Plans are on the verge of being realized. An impending boost of assistance reached completion. The need to realize this support is available. Feeling the need to protect one's plans, progress, or creations. Anticipating and being prepared for difficulties. Being vigilant and determined. Direct your energy towards practical considerations rather than the fears of the unknown. 
Six of Swords. Improvement, end of difficulties, peace restored, a necessary transition, a journey. After possibly a long period of difficulty, harmony is restored. Things may not be completed, but steady progress is now being made. Ability to cut one's losses in order to move into better circumstances. Leaving troubles behind, possible through changing jobs or relocating. An upcoming journey of some kind. So Sammy is gonna it's gonna be a hard time to accept the truth. I mean what what about the the love? Is there gonna be a love? Is I mean can you confirm what why do we need to get in a chariot? I mean you guys seem to Make it through hard times. Can you confirm what's going on here with Pisces? Um, birthday reading for um, the next few months. Yes, summer. The star. Go into hermit mode. While you're in hermit mode, you die and then be born. Unless you're dealing with a scorpionic energy or Scorpios in your chart. And then you get the whole world in your hands. You got the whole wide world with your lover. You get your lover. You get your lover. You get your lover. And you love her. Right? You love her. I'm sorry. Okay, the lovers come. They get the world. They're the star. Anything else for Pisces that they need to know for their birthday for the next couple of months? I mean, it's looking good. Good people, right? What do you think? Uh -huh. Huh? Oh, God. <laughs> it was what it was, but I'm not taking it because there's way too many cards. Mm hmm. I mean, she's the bitch of Tarot. She's the lawyer, or she's just, you know, a very stern woman that's in your life to get things done, you know? I don't know. You may be getting married, Pisces. Marriage looks like it's in your cards.
Get justice. Justice is served. Just gets, gets served. Yeah. I mean, you do have devil's energy. You do get the judgment. The high priestess steps forward. Somebody that's highly intuitive. Maybe you go see a high priestess, a psychic. That's at your, maybe your temperance. Mm. Then you get the sun. Something's illuminated. Right? Something gets illuminated. Gotta hang around. I don't know. Get the strength. Is the hair font again or? Making magic happen. Because you are the emperor. You get your ten of cups, which is happy life, happy wife, happy husband, kids, dog, white picketed fence. With your empress. Got a hermit. Cause you need to plant a seed. It's way too many cards. You need to plant a seed. What do you need to plant a seed for? Huh? You plant a seed to go on this journey to fight some battles because you need to face your karma. To get your justice, to be with your lover, to get your castle and all your pentacles and live happily ever after. What do you think? You just need the strength because you will get married. <laughs> will you get married? I don't know. Call me, let me know. Invite me to your wedding. Hmm? What do you think? Ooh. 
can. Wheel of Fortune's here. So you're gonna need your strength. As the tower falls, but your high priestess steps in. You get justice. Two of Cups. It's a twin flame. She shows at the end. Shows after the tower. Because you're making magic happen. Because you're going to get your Ace of Pentacles. All your money, honey. 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 That's it. We're done. Okay. So you're gonna go through a little bit of turbulence. But you're going to defeat all the odds. In the end, you're going to In the end <laughs> In the end In the end You're going to get your two of cups. So you're going to get your two of cups with death. I mean, or is your two of cups with a scorpionic energy? You know. And she's your queen of pentacles. And then after a couple, you know, putting the swords down, take your blindfold off, you know, then you become the knight of pentacles. And you guys live. Happily ever after. With your high priestess. <laughs> I don't know. That was fun. That was fun. You know? You know? Right? King of Wands, Two of Cups, again. Okay, your Wheel of Fortune. Looks like your fortune's going to be the Queen of Cups. The Queen of Cups. Queen of Cups.
You guys are gonna be the star. You'll be the star. Any advice for our Pisces for their birthday? You guys are gonna be the star. Just don't stop. I see 40, 40 on the clock. It'll be a peaceful resolution. The situation will improve. Yes. You are ready. You're ready, Freddy. No need to worry. Because within the next few months, within the next few months, let's just recover. <laughs> Let it go. Communicate clearly. Only if you believe. Ooh. Only if you believe. There are helpful people. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. That's it. We're gonna have to hang up. We're gonna have to go. We gotta go. We gotta go, go, go. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go, go, go. Happy birthday, Pisces. Love and light.